Good morning. Welcome to another episode of Front Daily 55 Chronicles. Hope you're having a great day. God bless and keep the faith. This morning I'll feature a piece from the Difficult Times album. It's called The Perishing Lily Field. Uh, for this piece, I used a nice drum setup, varying with some shakers, a nice acoustic bass, uh, the harp uh, for the cards, some nice low strings and Tony in some guitar and a bunch of other stuff, organ, piano freestyle over that piece. Uh, the lyrics deals with uh, needing help. Uh, it deals with the mixture of uh, lily, that lily flower perishing and not in the normal way that it's perishing, but it also describes your life. Oh, it feels sometimes. Sometimes it's in bloom, sometimes it's down and out. So the lyrics deals with that part. So without further ado, here's an entire run through of the piece. For this piece, uh, I don't know what happened during the mixing process, but the vocals could have been a bit higher in the piece. So until next time, hope you have a great day. Remember, God loves you. Jesus is the only way. The water didn't leave, and there is still the sun and the rain. Did you perish from the hurt and pain? The air is bleach, but it can't wash away the fiery stain, or shake the unsavory thoughts from the brain. I tried to lift you up, but it all fails through like open hand filled with grain. The roots are the last to go after the leaves and the branches can't maintain. I wished you had been planted in soft terrain. You hum songs only with sad refrains. A perishing little few don't give any more. The valley's so dry, but the hills are wet. We work and toil, drenched in sweat. The light tries to devour your silhouette. Who paid them to increase your debt? Tasked to remember what the world can forget. A little red in the violet. Silence flows from your beautiful clarinet. Sprinkled in a dance like Wheeling Antoinette, the perishing lily. Don't give any more, give any more. Don't give any more, give any more. I see weeds and dandelions in your place. I only could tell you face to face. Choked by the thorns, even through, even though you ask for space. I searched frantically, but you vanished without an embrace. How can the unmovable go on a chase? Could you have been safe in a face? Could you be written with ink so the rubber won't erase? Go back to the beginning to false start the race.